Hey, what's up guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you are new here, I am Randy with Beyond Limits of Palm Beach Mobile Detailing. And in today's video, we're gonna be going into Walmart and I'm gonna be showing you what in my opinion are some of the best detailing products you can find at a retail level. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. Alrighty guys, we are now inside Walmart and we're gonna go straight into some car wash shampoos. Our first product of the day is gonna be some Meguiar's Gold Class Car Wash Shampoo. This product here is $9 dollars and 67 cents so pretty much ten dollars uh, but i would highly recommend this product over here because out of all the shampoos that there are at walmart uh mcguire's gold class is the best in my opinion at a retail level uh, you can also add this in a bucket or use it in a foam can and it does foam up really nice for our second shampoo guys and our second product of the day is going to be some mcguire's washing wax from their ultimate line this one here is 13 dollars and 57 cents but i would say that it is a pretty nice shampoo uh, you can also use it on a foam cannon and a bucket. However, it doesn't foam up as nice as the gold class shampoo that I just showed you guys. Another product that I would recommend is right next to it. It's the Meguiar's All Wheel Cleaner from their Ultimate line again. And it's $10.97. Uh, this right here is an amazing product. A lot of people use it for their wheels. A lot of pros use it for their wheels as well. And I've seen a lot of pros also use it as an iron decon. So instead of buying, you know, like Car Pro Iron X, they'll go ahead and buy this Ultimate All Wheel Cleaner. Speaking about cleaning wheels guys, my next recommendation would be a wheel brush for the face of the wheel maybe. Uh, a lot of companies in my opinion produce this exact same brush, maybe different color. Uh, however, they're all ultimately the same exact brush. However, you probably only find the Chemical Guys version here at Walmart at a retail level. So uh, yeah, here's the wheel brush for Chemical Guys and it's $10.97. Right next to it, we have the tire brush from Chemical Guys. Again, this one here is for the tire itself. And in my opinion, it's kind of too big and wide. But if you have no other option, I would go with this one. Just be very careful when you're using it on your tires because it can always touch the wheels and you don't want to scratch the wheels. This one right here is also 1097, just like the wheel brush. Up next, we have here the Meguiar's Hot Shine Tire Coating. This one over here runs for 697. And I would highly recommend this aerosol can to any beginner or DIYer out there trying to shine up their tires. Right next to it, we have the Insane Shine Tire Coating from Meguiar's Ultimate line. And this one seems to be a little bit more expensive than this one right here. So I can only imagine how it performs as usually Meguiar's Ultimate line have best of the best products. Down here, we have the Crystal Products Untouchable Wet Tire Finish Tire Shine. It is an aerosol can and it's 447. So it's probably the cheapest one out of all of these tire dressings or tire shines. And I think I've used this maybe once in my lifetime at a personal level. I really can't remember how well it went. Uh, but let me know down in the comments, guys, if you want a comparison between all these tire shines from the cheapest to the slightly more expensive ones. Here we have also from Meguiar's uh, the liquid wax from the Ultimate Line again. This one right here is $21.88. And I can say that I've had great experiences with this wax over here. <laughs> they stole it. There's nothing in here. In my opinion. It's a super easy and simple wax to start off with and use on your vehicles if you're just a beginner or just a DIYer. Unfortunately, I think they stole this because there's nothing in here, so yeah. Another wax you can find here at Walmart, it's the Butter Wet Wax from Chemical Guys. This bottle here is $17.97, so $18. I've used this in the past maybe once, and uh, when I used it, the paint did really pop after finishing waxing the vehicle. However, I really can't speak on how long it lasts for. Uh, I think it claims to be three to six months. In my opinion, maybe two to three weeks tops. Now we have the wax and dry from Turtle Wax. This spray bottle here is $6.87, which is pretty much $7. Uh, this one here is a spray wax that you can apply while the car is still wet. And then you can finally go ahead and start drying. I don't know why any Walmart I go to, they never carry Turtle Wax Seal and Shine. The first version or the second version, the better version. That is a top notch product in my opinion. Very professional grade in my opinion again. Who knows, maybe that's why they stopped selling them on the shelves or maybe they just run out of them really quick. But in my opinion, the sealant shine from Turtle Wax is probably the best spray wax or best sealant out there in a spray bottle at a retail level. Up next, we have these coating and wax applicators. They are $5.97 for a two pack here at Walmart. And uh, believe it or not, these applicators here get the job done. They don't need any lint and they cover a good amount of paint when waxing a vehicle. So it makes it super easy to finish a vehicle really fast all around. Now here I have a two-sided microfiber washman. This one from Auto Drive, and it's $6 here at Walmart. Uh, you can't go wrong with this two-sided microfiber washman. These are probably on the cheaper end, so they could not last as long as you probably might want it to last. But if you want to find good ones, you can go on Amazon. Otherwise, at a retail level, 
Walmart is probably your best bet. Now we have the leather detailer from Meguiar's from their ultimate line once again, and it's $9.97, so $10. This one here is a three steps in one, so it basically cleans, restores, and protects all at once when using this product on your leather seats or leather material within your vehicle. I do want to mention that Chemical Guys also has their own products when it comes to cleaning your leather seats or restoring them. Uh, here we have a leather quick detailer. This one right here is $12, and they have the conditioner right next to it, which is $20. So a total of $32 compared to the $10 where you have three steps all in one spray bottle. So the choice is up to you guys. You want to spend $10 or uh, $32 for two bottles. Here at Walmart, they also have this four pack uh, drill brush cleaning kit. It's only $10, $9.97. Uh, I can't really say how long it will last you being it's only $10. But if you don't have access to maybe online or Amazon, you can always find this at Walmart and uh, I would give it a shot for $10. I mean, can't go wrong with it. Now here we have the Tough Stuff Multi-Purpose Foam Cleaner. This one helps you get rid of small spots or stains on your fabric seats. And it's only $4.47, so around $4.50. And I would say that this is a great product. However, the can does go by fast. Same thing goes with the McGuire's Carpet and Upholstery Cleaner, which is $3 more. So I'd probably just go with the Tough Stuff Multi-Purpose Foam Cleaner. And another great recommendation is the Sprayway World's Best Glass Cleaner for only $2.94, so basically $3. And it's a great recommendation in my opinion for the quality and its price you simply can't just beat that and here we have some simple and basic quick detailer from mcguire this one is 850 so eight dollars and fifty cents and it's a, your average quick detailer that you use to go around the vehicle when you're finished with detailing and want to touch up any spots we also have the smooth surface clay kit from mcguire's this one is 22.88 so 23 dollars and i've used this a lot in the past and i can say it can actually provide professional like results when using it or doing it right I should note that Chemical Guys also has a clay kit and this one here seems like a good deal to me in my opinion. It's a six item kit and this one here is about $10 more. It comes to a total of $29.88 so $30 compared to the McGuire's clay kit for $23 so $7 more actually. Uh, but it does bring a car wash soap or shampoo and it also brings a wax to wax your vehicle after you finish clean barring your car's paint. So I might have to test it out. Let me know down in the comments if you want me to go ahead and test this kit out, guys, on a vehicle. Another kit I would recommend is this McGuire's Heavy Duty Headlight Restoration Kit for $30, $29.88. So it is $30, but it can also give you professional-like results when using it correctly. So definitely a professional-like great product. Usually there's not a lot of Chemical Guys products that I recommend, but if I do have to recommend one or two guys, I would definitely go with some PRP here. Uh, it's a vinyl rubber plastic protectant so basically if you want to dress any rubber or plastic inside your vehicle you can always use vrp from chemical guys highly recommend it great product from chemical guys and it's 15 dollars here at walmart so keep that in mind guys 15 dollars for some vrp so this happens to be the very first time i ever see these microfiber towels here at walmart these are some yellow towels microfiber towels extra large multi-purpose and it comes in a 50 pack and they're only running for 20 dollars so it doesn't seem like a bad deal to me I just can't really speak for the quality as I've never used these. However, I'm not going to lie. They look just like the ones from Costco, the Kirkland brand. So I might have to go ahead and compare these both. This one is a 50 pack for $20. And I believe the one at Kirkland or Costco, I mean, is a uh, 36 pack for $25. So this one screams a better deal. However, I don't know about its quality. So I might just have to go ahead and test them out. Now, you know, I can't forget about some super clean guys. This right here is a super versatile cleaner and degreaser, which you can use for a lot of purposes when uh, you dilute them accordingly. And this gallon here is $10.37. But remember that when you dilute this, this one gallon turns into more than one gallon. And that one here, we have the famous Zep spray bottles. These are professional spray bottles that you can pour in any chemical you like, dilute it, add water, whatever chemical you want to pour into. These are only $3.37, so about $3.50 each. And you can grab a couple and you're good to go. Last but not least, guys, I know it's not ideal to get microfiber towels here at Walmart as they don't probably have the best quality over here. However, if you have no other choice or just looking for the cheapest, you know, beginning kit out there, go ahead and grab you some microfiber towels here in this section where you can grab 100 microfiber towels for $25. You heard that right, $24.97 to be exact, so $25. And it brings a total of 100 microfiber towels. Again, it has four colors, so you have yellow, gray, green, and blue. And you can use each color for different purposes. For example, the blue ones can be for the interior, the yellow ones can be for the exterior, the gray ones can be for like the door jams, and the green one for the wheels, completely up to you. Again, 100 pack for $25. I just don't see how you can go wrong with that. And honestly, these don't seem like the cheap ones, like in the car wash section. These actually seem pretty nice and uh, multi-purpose microfiber towels. So 
definitely give them a try i guess if you're a walmart you can't go wrong for 25 dollars and here we have some mcguire's interior detailer from their ultimate line again this interior detailer helps you clean the inside all around and i would say that this right here does the job does it better than expected it's just a matter of volume so for example this spare bottle here may last you maybe two cars three tops and in a detailing business, you want to be as profitable as possible. So if you were to buy this, you just wouldn't be profitable buying it at $10 a spray bottle. Again, this one seems like a very small spray bottle. So just compare that to buying a gallon for maybe 25 bucks. And that gallon itself, whether you dilute it or not, will last you for 10 cars plus. So it's not about whether these are good interior detailers or not. It's more of like you want to be profitable, how long they will last you, how long do you have to restock, and you get the idea, guys. And by the looks of it, guys, it seems like Meguiar's actually has some gold class line and they have some leather and vinyl cleaners as well as some leather conditioners and they seem to be only like seven dollars a piece so a total of 14 dollars for both so you can go ahead and clean your leather or vinyl seats with this cleaner over here and top it off with some leather conditioner from gold class mcguire's brand so back when i started detailing and i came to walmart a lot of these things weren't here it's only been recently where they have a lot of you know good detailing product in my opinion and one of the things is the detailing brushes this right here is a two-piece detailing brush so I've mentioned it in the past that you can maybe use this one right here, the stiff one for the exterior, maybe for like your wheels or tires, and this one for the inside. This one seems very close to the one that I have, which is from a good company, which that brush maybe was like around 15 bucks. And this itself, this two piece is $6. So that kind of tells you a big price difference. So I don't know if there's a difference in quality. I would assume so, but I got to give it a try to actually say that. And uh, if you want to start off, and detailing give it a fresh try you can't go wrong with this interior detailing brush and exterior detailing brush for those of you wondering if maybe these tire and trim applicators maybe to apply your tire dressing onto the wheels are good i would say stay away from these because these after your first use they, they tend to break and uh they're just not good not reliable so i would probably go a different direction instead of getting these guys randy we see a lot of mcguire's chemical guys turtle wax mothers and armor oil and walmart how would you rank them from best to maybe not the best so how i would rank them from maybe best to maybe not the best i'd probably start off with mcguire's on top turtle wax after mother's third and chemical guys fourth place and at last i'd go with armor oil they also have jay leno's garage black magic but i just can't really speak for them as i haven't used their products in the past Real quick guys, let me know down below any other stores you'd like for me to go and see the retail detailing products. In my opinion, Walmart will have the best detailing products retail wise and sometimes their online website will have even more to offer and usually the best prices as they tend to price match as well. So otherwise guys, go ahead and find professional grade products on Amazon or even detailing suppliers website. That's gonna be a wrap for the video guys. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you found it super helpful and took something from it. If you did, please be sure to smash the like button and leave a comment down below to help with the YouTube algorithm. And if you aren't subscribed to my channel already, go ahead and click that subscribe button as well as that notification bell button to be in the loop of all my next videos in the near future. As always guys and girls, see you on the next one.